Welcome to Excel 2010 preview number five. Hey, Excel 2010 technical preview just came out about a week or two ago. And I'm just going to show you, I've already showed you a couple of my favorite things. In this one, I want to show you conditional formatting. Now, here we are in uh, 2010. I'm going to go over to Excel 2007. Let's just look at data bars, data bars in 2007. I'm going to go up to the home ribbon and then styles, conditional formatting, data bars, and it's sort of off to the side. Oh, that's too bad. I'm going to let's just scoot this over right here. Home, styles, conditional formatting, data bars, and there you can see it. So I'm going to click on this one right here. So that's pretty nice. Uh, it's kind of gradiated. Now let's go over to uh, 2000 and 10 and look at what they've done here. Same place, home, uh, styles, conditional formatting, and data bars, they have either gradient or solid. I love this solid. Why do I love it? Because it looks just like a bar chart or uh, a column chart, but bars are, are this way. So that's uh, one thing they've done. Look at this. This is another amazing thing they've done. Let's come back to 2007, and I want to randomize these values to show negative. So I'm going to have randomize these from uh, negative 10 to 10. And you can see that the smallest uh, values, the negative 9, that gets the smallest bar. But there's no real indication visually that there's any negatives there. In 2000 and uh, 10, if we put a minus 10 here to randomize, whoops, I didn't do the uh, rand here, equals rand between the bottom, comma, the top, close parentheses. Let me go like this. Whoops. And I need to lock both of those. Oh my heavens, look at that. Oh, <laughs> they're going to allow you to show, they actually get to visually show you that that's a negative. And it maxes out. There's the 10, and the positives get the green. Now let's uh, can, uh, randomize this, and you can see, sure enough, it does it. Now you can also do the same thing. So that's just in a, a little cell chart there. We can go back up to Home, Styles, Formatting, Data Bars. I think I'm going to try the gradient this time. That one right there. So negatives will be in red and uh, uh, positives will be in green. So that's just a few things they've done. Definitely the uh, data bars, which I do use uh, to uh, visualize data. I love the fact that we can have negatives now. And you can also have either gradiated or solid. All right, we'll see you next preview.